In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can use the Confluence Dashboards plugin to replace your actual Confluence Dashboard. This tutorial will just show you how to take an existing Confluence Dashboards plugin layout and use it on your dashboard. If you need help creating the initial layout, then please refer to our other documentation at plugins.adaptivist.com. The default Confluence Dashboard looks something like this. It's OK, but with the Confluence Dashboards plugin, you can make the screen more useful for your end users by allowing them to customize it to their needs. First, we start by creating our default layout using the Confluence Dashboards plugin macros. Once we are happy with it, we then want to embed this within the dashboard's layout. You can do this by going to the Confluence admin screen and selecting layouts. The dashboard layout is defined by the global layout decorator. You can customize this by selecting create custom. We then want to replace the main dashboard table with the updated code provided in the recipe on the Confluence Dashboard's plugin page. For simplicity, this replaces the layout with the include macro. We want to update the parameters in the include macro. In this case, we use ds for the space key and new dashboard for the page title. You can then save your layout. The dashboard will now include this layout and looks like this.